Hey kids, it's Miss Jennifer. I really missed you guys. And I'm here to share family Bible time with you one more time before we get to come back to church. I'm so excited. So our verse today is Genesis 1:27, and it says, So God created human beings in His image. In the image of God, He created them. He created them male and female. Did you know that you are a miracle? It's true. You're a crazy, amazing miracle. Even though you're tiny compared to the vastness of all the universe, the trees, the stars, everything that God put into place, you're tiny, but you're created in God's image. That's right. The God who breathed the fiery, ferocious stars up into the sky, he is the one who crafted and created you. In Psalms 139.14, it says that you are fearfully and wonderfully made. And that means that you're made in an amazing and wonderful way. You began in your mother's womb when God created a unique, never before seen guide on how he would build you. Think of it like a blueprint. A blueprint is a plan, like a builder uses when he's going to build a big building or construct a house or something like that. It has all of the details of exactly what you need to do to make that house turn out exactly how he wants it. So your blueprint is called DNA. That's short for a really long word called deoxyribonucleic acid? I can't even say it. Let's try again. Deoxyribonucleic acid. A little better. Try that one five times fast. Anyway, it contains all the information for how you look and function from the color of your eyes to the hair on your head to the shape of your toenails. <laughs> um, your DNA describes exactly how God wanted you to be. And there's never been and never will be anyone with the same DNA as you. There's only one you, so no one can ever be like you again. Now, scientists have figured out that God's DNA code for you is three billion characters long. So a character is like a letter or a number. So in the word dad, D-A-D, -D, there's three characters. So in this DNA character is three billion characters long. That's really, really, really long. So, this DNA code that's planted inside every cell of your body, and then all the cells function and grow according to that same master plan. Your body has 37.2 trillion cells, and they each follow God's grand design to make you exactly into who he planned you to be, even before you were born. So your hair, whether you have blonde hair or black hair or brown hair or silver hair like Miss Jennifer does, um, or you have blue eyes like me or brown eyes or green eyes or hazel eyes, that all is part of your DNA. Everything is exactly the way that God designed them to be. An amazing and wonderfully designed miracle called you. It's really exciting to think that God made you and nobody else is ever, ever going to be exactly like you. So maybe when you're feeling a little sad or lonely or maybe not special, just remember that God put DNA together so you would be exactly like you and that you are his miracle and all of those cells and all of that DNA in those cells um, is a masterpiece that he put together to create you. 
I love you guys. Don't forget that you are a miracle. And I'll see you very soon at church. I'm so excited. Bye, guys.